hello really quickly before we go into the video i have a couple things to say and then we'll get right into it i know this is a long video but i'm gonna say these really quickly first things first i have an ep coming out it's called brain machine broke i'll leave a link down below to where you can pre-save it i also have two singles out from that ep already and i'll leave links down below to where you can go stream it the name of the songs are her name is hope and afraid next thing i have a podcast called the Afterbody podcast with me and my friends b and brian and basically what we're doing is watching every episode of the vampire diaries the originals and legacies in that order if that sounds like something you're interested in i'll leave a link down below to where you can go check it out and finally i have links down below to resources about everything that's going on in the world that's a mess because the world is currently a mess please go check that out for if you want to get educated on certain things if you want to sign up some petitions or donate to some places and that's it let's get into the video oh i'm so hot i'm like sweating bullets i feel like i haven't recorded from this angle since like years ago when i did uh, like vita that was so, such a long time ago. It was like two years ago. Oh my gosh. Anyways, sweating bullets currently for you. Please recognize that. Also, I feel like there should be more light down here. So I'm going to bring this light down here. Um, I feel like I should bring another light down here just to make it not look so bad. Because the light is currently from up top. Let me go get it. Oh, how's that? Is that better? Yeah, so much better. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is amazing. Okay. It's so weird about my glasses, but it's so hot. I want to put them on. I need to look on. Oh. Hello. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Jordan, and on this channel, I usually do original songs and covers. But for today's video, I'm doing something a little bit different, which I've been doing a lot of different stuff, like more lifestyle stuff recently. Um, I don't know. I just really enjoy watching those types of videos, so I kind of want to make more of them even if they're not completely music related because i don't know i just kind of want to show more of myself here on youtube like back in the old days like three years ago when i made, made videos so um today we are cleaning my room because it's currently a mess i know you can't see that it's a mess from the angle that i'm at right now but my floor is atrocious it needs to be clean and basically what happened a couple days ago not a couple days ago like a few weeks ago I went back to my college to get my things because I don't know if you know this but I had to leave during spring break while we were the pandemic just started skyrocketing off and I left all my stuff there not all my stuff but like a good majority of my stuff there because I only brought back what I could fit in my suitcases and then the rest was left in boxes so I went back there a few weeks ago to go grab all my stuff and then come all the way back and now here we are um with I have a whole bunch of stuff actually what's on my floor is not even all my things this is just the majority of my clothes that I brought back but I also have like trinkets and just like stuff that I had there that I just brought back with me because I didn't know if I wanted to keep it or not. So I think we're gonna do declu a decluttering type video slash cleaning video. This might be like a two day project um, because I have other stuff I need to do today. I can't just film this all day. But basically we're just gonna go through my clothes that I came back with and see what I want, what I don't want. And we're gonna do the same with my closet. I don't know if we're gonna do that today. Um, but overall my goal today is just to get the floor clean. Maybe also my desk because my desk is also a mess. Um, but the floor and my desk are my main priorities and then we'll move on to other stuff later on. So, with that being said, I have a pile of clothes here that I need to get started on, so we're gonna start on that. And then oh, we're gonna see also what I'm gonna keep, like right now, what, I'm gonna, what else I'm gonna like put in the basement and then what I'm gonna give away. Cause it's like end of summer, beginning into fall, so I kinda want those types of clothes. Um, and then I'll put mostly like heavy winter stuff and which I don't think I have a lot from college because I went to school in California. They had no heavy winters, but um, in my closet I might have heavy winter stuff. So I'm getting, I'm going to put like really, really summer stuff um, in the basement and heavy winter stuff in the basement. And then my like more spring, fallish type clothes, I'm going to um, see what's in here to take out and to keep. Um, so let's get started um first we have these pants these are my pants i like these pants let me keep them and i guess we'll just throw the pile right next to me right here for stuff i'm keeping this is a hoodie oh my gosh okay so this hoodie says what is a on it um if you've ever watched little liars 
this is some of their merch that they had with i think it was american eagle or h&m or one of their stores i wonder if it's on the back it's with it was with aeropostale that's who it was with do they still make stuff but anyways i was like really 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 into their stuff like i had like shirts that just said aeropostale i don't know why i don't even think i really liked their clothes because i didn't really have a sense of style back then because every single day I would wear a uniform to school from like kindergarten to high school so I didn't really have a sense of style so I just thought oh that sounds cool I guess I'll wear it but I, looking back it was a bad decision but I love this hoodie I only watched up to like season two or three of Pretty Little Liars but during that time they did come out with merch with their hair passed out and I got this hoodie and another shirt I convinced my mom to get me it and I honestly I love this hoodie so much it's so comfortable and it's one of my favorite stories to tell about this hoodie because I was really into that show for a second. I'm gonna keep this. I think even though it could be heavy winter stuff, I'm gonna keep it for fall because I just like wearing it in general. I don't care what time of the year it is, I love a good hoodie. Oh my gosh, okay, so this is my jacket. I got this like three years ago, I think. Um, and it kind of also has stains on it, which I didn't realize, but it looks like super vintage now just because I've worn it so many times and I've had it for so long. But like it has my class pin on there from the year I graduated. You can't see it really. And I don't have auto focus on, so maybe I'll try to zoom in with the camera. Um, I mean in editing, but or I'll like take a picture and show it on the screen, but that's what it's on there. I kind of already have a jacket for pins though now. But this is just like a nice fall jacket in general, so I'll keep it and I'll hang it up. This is a cardigan. <laughs> Taylor cardigan by Taylor Swift. Go stream it. Um, but this is a type of cardigan. I don't really wear it that much because I don't know what to wear with it, but I feel like it would go well with like gray stuff. I usually really match the maroon color on here with my pant with the pair of pants that I have, but I don't know if I still have those pair of pants. Um, but I'll keep it for now. I'll see if I wear it this fall, and if I don't, I'll give it away. Also, all this stuff needs to be cleaned. I'm gonna do laundry for this as well because it needs to be cleaned. It's been in boxes for like months now. This is a shirt that has a pineapple on it. I don't really like it. I think I might give this away. Um, just cause I don't really wear it. It's more like a shirt, like, oh, it's laundry day, I'll wear this shirt. But I don't really like it as a shirt to just wear in general. It's not fun. It's not my style. Um, it's not my type of graphic tee. So I think I'm gonna give that away. I don't put the stuff I'm gonna give away over there. I've never worn this jacket, this vest, but I wanna wear it so badly. I just never had the right outfit for it. But here's what the vest looks like. It's like green. And it has this like really cool stitching on the back like quilt i want to wear this so badly and i think i finally have like the right clothes to wear with this finally so i think i'm gonna wear this this fall also because whenever it's fall i go back to california and i had this in california but like it always felt too hot to wear this so i'm excited i think i'll finally be able to wear this this year i'm gonna keep it uh, oh let me tell you about this I love this cardigan so much. I think I bought it last year, um, but it's like this beautiful, I don't, it's showing up much brighter on camera, I think, but it's this beautiful orange, yellow, mustardy, dirty color. I love it so much. It's such a good cardigan and it goes well with so many of my things. I love this thing. I'm keeping it. I'm keeping a lot of stuff, which is not good because I don't have a lot of room in my closet, but here we are um okay so this is a pair of cargo pants my mom gave me they don't really fit me that well but what i really want like in the waist they don't fit me that well they fit me fine in the legs but in the waist it's a little too big i might try to go to a tailor because my mom knows a tailor and try to get it fixed i also just might want like a really i need a really nice black belt because i feel like a really nice black or brown belt would look wonderful with these and then i can really rock these so i'm keeping these i love these i just need a good belt for them and then i can rock them how i want to this is a jacket i found in the thrift store it's very good i'm keeping it it's very cool um it's like a little blazer moment I like this jacket. I'm keeping it. I like wearing this. I don't really wear scarves anymore, but I have a whole bunch of them. I don't know if I want to give these away or keep them and see if I wear them. I don't know. Oh, there's an ice cream truck going outside my room. So if you hear that, that's what that is. Um, there's always ice cream truck going outside my room because I live near a park. So, um, but I don't know if I want to keep these. I have like a whole bunch of these, like scarves, and I don't wear them. 
but I could get into them. This is like, this could be like a little, like a little this moment, you know, like a little this moment. So this is like different, but this is like a, like a scarf scarf. You know what I mean? I don't know. I'll keep it and then see how I feel about it next year when I probably do clutter again. These are some Hollister pants. I don't know how I got them, but they definitely are too small for me. I usually wear them when I don't have any other pants to wear and I need, um, and I need, what's it called? And I need just pants to wear for like laundry days and I don't want to do laundry yet. But I, I, these don't fit me. I don't like wearing them. I'm going to give them away. This is a cute little like sweater moment. It's like see-through. I don't think you can see it like it's see-through like that. I like this sweater. I've only worn it like one time, but I want to wear it more. I think I'm just kind of scared for, about it because it is so see-through. But I think if I get like a really good black bra, this is perfect. For especially like the fall time, I, I feel like if I'm going out. I mean, I'm not going out anytime soon because pandemic, but you get what I mean. We have a sweatshirt. This is Aeropostale. Yeah, for a moment, like I said, for a good time, I was, I had a lot of Aeropostale stuff, but I like the sweater. It's very nice. I'll be keeping it. This has another like little scarf moment. I also can wear this as like on my, on top of my head. It's like that. All this stuff also needs to get washed. I think I said that already. So I'm going to wash a lot of this. Okay. Now we're just moving into like shoes and stuff that's on the floor. And I also have this ukulele bag for my, um, my concert ukulele that I brought home. Um, and I think I'm going to put these underneath my bed where all my other, um, what's it called? Like my, all my other instrument bags are. They are all underneath my bed and I kind of need to, I don't know. It's all kind of crammed underneath there because I have like, I have a violin, two guitars, a ukulele, and then this other ukulele. But that guitar doesn't have a case. It, no, it did come with a case. Why am I forgetting that it came with a case? So, yeah. It's a lot of stuff. It's a lot of stuff. Okay, we have these shoes. I kind of just keep these because I feel like they're good running shoes. And I don't go running a lot anymore. But maybe I'll start exercising again sometime soon. <laughs> I actually do think I want to keep all these things that I have here on the shoe size because I do remember going through my shoes when I went to um, get my things and being like, I want to keep this, I, wanna, I don't want to keep these. So actually, I think all the shoes here are fine. I do just have to put them away on my shoe rack. And if they don't fit on my shoe rack, I have to find a place for them. But also, some of these might not be able to be worn for a while. Actually, no. The boots can stay because I like to wear boots all year long. Oh, but hold on, really quickly, look at these sneakers. It has like little dogs on it, and then it came with a pack of stickers. I love these sneakers so much. They're so cute. Okay, I think that's everything. Everything else on the floor is just stuff. So now I'm just going to go pick up the stuff, if that makes sense. That's what we're doing now. Um, but yeah, the stuff, that's what I'm gonna do. So, probably like a little montage of that. And then I'm going to clean off I'm gonna put this stuff in a laundry bag. Um, put that stuff that I don't want anymore in like an actual garbage bag. Put the stuff I, oh, not in the garbage, not like a garbage bag to throw it out, but to give to Goodwill. My mom actually has some stuff she says she wants to give to Goodwill, so I probably will give that to her. And then I'm gonna put the stuff that I wanna keep, but put in the basement. I'm just gonna put it downstairs. And then we will get to the shoes, put the shoes away, and then we'll get to my desk and then probably try to fit more, um, take stuff out of my closet. But we'll see how the rest of this video goes.
Okay, so like really quickly, I have this succulent that I got as a gift in like a care package. And I kind of want to repot it, but I don't want to go outside. So I'm just going to do it really quickly in this garbage bag with this small ceramic pot that I have. And I already have soil, so I'm just going to replant it. Who bought it? Here's the soil. Came in this bag. Succulent slash cactus soil. I'm just going to put it over here. Put a little down. Hopefully it fits in this. I actually don't know if it will. We might have to trim her a little bit so she fits. Well, would she fit better in this one is the question. Should I have another one? And like, I just think it needs like a little bit of a trim. So I'm just gonna take some of the dirt off so it can fit. Okay, so. We're potting it and we're potting her in here. So it's still a little messy. It's okay, I have more whites. So right now what I'm doing is I'm kind of getting rid of the sides. It doesn't really matter. And then we can place her more easily in there. I'll just replace more of the soil. I don't know, I feel like this pot might be a little too small. Maybe I'll put it, but this one's a little too deep, I feel like. This one's too deep, this one's too small. Like, too not small in like deepness, but in width. But hopefully it fits, because I really want to put it in this one. Look, can you see? Like how it's kind of like not fully fitting? Okay, I think I'm gonna put it in this one, because this one is a little wider. I don't know, maybe I'll get a better pot, but for now, we shall do with that. There we go. Oh, that's better. And then we'll just pack it in on the side for a little. I kind of need to wash this off, but it's fine. We are good to go. Okay, now that it's done, I'm gonna clean the rest of this off, the dirt off my table, and then move on to my next activity, which is sweeping the floor. So, it's currently raining outside. If you can hear that, you can probably hear that. But I'm gonna record now because I wanna clean now. So, that is what's going on. Anyways, this is my closet. It's full of stuff. And today, I'm gonna clean it out. This is another part of the same video. From yesterday, um, and I have more clothes I also need to sort through that's outside of my door because I just remember about it. But we'll get to that. These I'm obviously gonna keep because I wear them. This is, these are walls that I've worn before. This is a shirt I've worn many times. Keeping these. This is just a sweatshirt with my school on it. Keeping it because I love, not sweatshirt, a hoodie. And I love hoodies, so I'm keeping it. Another sweatshirt, I don't love this one, but I'll keep it because it goes with my jogging set and it's warm. This is a coat that I got from a thrift shop. It's so nice, but it's too big for me. I need to take this to the tailor so that they alter this for me. So maybe I'll put this in a separate pile. This is a jacket that I don't wear from when I was a kid. I'm going to give this away. This is a nice dress shirt. I don't love it, but it's always nice to have a good black top, so I'll keep it. This is a, I don't know what material this is, but it's a button-up shirt. I don't really like it. I'm gonna get rid of it. This is something I stole from my mom. I didn't steal it from her, she gave it to me. It's like a little sweater, I guess you'd call it. It's really cute, kind of librarian-ish. And I am just looking for the perfect white like tank top or t-shirt to wear underneath this with like a nice pair, like a nice green mini skirt. That's what I want to wear with this. 
Don't know if I'll ever get there, but I'm keeping it. A cardigan of some kind? I don't like the way this looks. I think it's supposed to probably come down around your neck, but I already don't like it. I'm giving it away. This is a cute jacket. I'm keeping it, obviously. It's very cute. This is a green button down. I keep this if I need to go somewhere nice because it's a nice, like, silky kind. It's not made of silk, but it looks like it is. So I keep it because it's nice. It's like, maybe it's like chevron. Um, but I'm gonna keep this. Also, I'm sweating so hard, y'all. Sweating so hard for this video because I have lights on. Because it's overcast outside. Okay, this is a denim dress. I don't really wear it that much anymore. I might keep it for a while, but I also might give it away. I'll keep it for now. Um, I don't love it anymore, but it is kind of cute. This is a leatherish, it's not real leather, jacket with like this little white thing in the middle of it. I think it could still be worn kind of cute if I found the right outfit, so I'll keep it. This is a green flowery shirt, I think. I don't think I've worn this. I might keep it, I might give it away. I don't know if I see myself wearing this, but it is cute, so I'll put it in the keep pile for now. If I don't wear it like within the year, I'm giving it away. This is a cute little top, but I don't see myself wearing it. And this is like a dress, but I also don't see myself wearing this. Um, this is, I mean, I, I think I'm gonna give this away, most definitely. I don't wear that. This I've worn before. I don't even know if it fits me well anymore. I'll keep it for now and then I'll see. I'll see. Okay, I'm taking off my glasses. It's too hot. They're sliding off my face because my face is so sweaty right now. It's, I have like all these lights on in my room so that you can see me, but it's hot lights. So we're taking off my glasses. This is a jean jacket. I think it's my mom's. So I would put this in the pile of my mom's things that she needs to get out of my closet. Oh, this is my graduation skirt. I'll keep it. I wore this to graduation. It's very long and nice. And if I have more nice events, I probably will wear it again because I like this skirt. Don't like this shirt anymore. Giving it away. Um, This is the other thing that I got from Pretty Little Liars. Um, the little merch that they had. And I really like this shirt. I think it's a nice shirt. I'm, I'm going to keep it. Oh, this is from when I went to Korea with my school. I went to George Mason University. This is a nice hoodie. I'm keeping it. This is a jacket I wear. It's, I think I showed you it already and, and I'm keeping it. Oh no, I showed you a different one, but this is another jean jacket. Looks vintage now because I've worn it so many times. I'm keeping it. I had pins on this originally. And they've all kind of mostly fallen off, so I have to repin this. I haven't worn this yet, but I'm so excited to find an outfit that I can wear this with. Because look how cool this rain jacket I got from a thrift store is. I think I showed this in another video earlier this year. I love this jacket so much. Don't like this anymore at all. Giving it away. I don't think this is me anymore. Giving it away. Oh, this is a pink shirt. Don't think it's me anymore. Giving it away. A pair of good overalls, keeping it. Okay, I think we're just getting into my mom's stuff in my closet. This is all of hers. I'm just gonna put her stuff off to the side. I think this top row is mainly coats, some skirts, like gowns from when I graduated, and then some dresses. Um, I think I might put them away because I'm not going to wear them anytime soon. And I'll keep the ones that are more like party dresses as if I'm going to a party anytime soon due to COVID. Um, but we won't really go through this hop because that's usually just coats and stuff. Maybe we'll see which, some coats I actually don't want. So let's get rid of those. Like this coat, I don't want her anymore. Yeah, the rest of these can stay. I just didn't want that one. And then for skirts, I mean, I don't really wear skirts. I don't think I know how to style them correctly. So I'll keep them. Maybe I'll figure it out. I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna clean out the bottom of my closet now. You can watch that. And then I'm gonna put stuff back in. And that will be it for this portion of the video.
Okay, I'm currently using my phone to record my voice. Um, but that's it for this video. Um, I had a really, I don't want to say fun time because this was very like time intensive and I'm sweating from this experience um, because it's hot and I don't turn on the AC because I don't want to cause any problems with the audio that there already probably is from recording from my phone. But that was me cleaning out my closet and cleaning up my room. I really enjoy watching these types of videos, so I hope you guys had a good time watching this, my version of it. Um, and maybe I'll try to do more of these, I don't know. I try not to keep my room as messy as it got, but when I'm not in a good headspace, it happens sometimes. Um, but yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Um, subscribe the goal for the year is a thousand and we are we're not close <laughs> we're at we're close to 300 um, but I'm manifesting a new subscriber every day so hopefully we'll gain one from this from you watching this video if you've not subscribed to me and you want to subscribe go ahead and subscribe it's a good time over here um, and uh, comment down below any tips you have for cleaning I think I want to do a room tour next so that's on the list um, my room isn't like fully complete. I have some like things coming that needs to get here faster before I can fully do that. But hopefully I have that up soon. Um, but yeah, that's it for this video. Hope you guys are having a nice day, a nice week, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.